Hi everyone, so I'm back to share another journal with you. Um, this one, I'm calling it Embrace because that's the little sticker that I put on the front. It's not a sticker actually, it's a digital from Artie Mays. So, um, there's no real theme. It's got a mixture of birds and flowers and the only thing that's consistent is there's bits of green all the way through it. Um, the journal measures, I haven't written anything down. Let's see, it measures eight, whoops, by four and a half. It has one signature. Don't know how many pages, but it will be for sale and it will be listed over on my website. Um, you'll find all the details on the listing, um, size wise. And well, I've just told you the size, but um, pages and things. Okay, so I've used this from Artie Mays. Uh, can't remember the name of the kit. It's a green collage one I can't remember what it's called but anyway I used that this on the background here is from my butterfly journal card kit which is on uh, my coffee shop this is a freebie from my coffee shop and like I said the word is from Artie Mays we have got eyelets and we have got this fabric as a closure which I need to pull away some of the um, the extra stringy bits as you can see um, so let's find there we go okay so there you can see I've used things from Artie Mays like my own stuff uh, um, Tracy Fox who else did I use uh, Ruby and Pearl XO the old design shop and I'll mention anything as I go through okay so I used an envelope um, for the cover and I coffee dyed it and then I put this um, on the outside obviously and so it sewed, sewn that on, sewed it on, sewed, I stitched it right here is a pocket and this is from the old design shop there is a little pocket there not a little pocket, a little page little page Sorry about that car that's gone up and down. It is roaring, if you can hear it. And that just goes in there, so you can write on that, and then you can tuck that in. Then we have this, which is, like I said, the old design shop. This is Digital Washi from Chapter One. This was a little um, cluster that I made using scrap pieces, and uh, this is from the old design shop that is Artie Mays and so is that. Then here, like I said, it has got a hint of green all the way through. Um, these are the little clusters that I made and the page, uh, the pocket is paper from Artie Mays. The tags I believe are from Tag Fabrication which was a collaboration between Artie Mays and Tracy Fox. So I've used them, I've kept some plain I've got to stitch them on with some coffee dyed fabric um, and as you can see that's been stitched on that's a big long piece there there's little bugs everywhere because if you don't know I'm going to tell you now I have a shed at the side of the house so I'm kind of out in the garden <laughs> um, so yeah and the door I've only just shut the door so I've, I've got the wilderness is coming in to see me um, so yeah that that is from Ruby and Pearl the whatchamacallit oh there's honestly there's loads of little tiny bugs um, what's that from I don't know what that's from I can't remember, it's one of my kits, I can't remember what it is. I think it's just a, a butterfly freebie over on my coffee shop. Digital washi in the background there and the word dream is from Artie Mays. And then here we've got another tag which is, the tag is tag fabrication, the ticket is Artie Mays, the image here is ruby and pearl, that is from one of my freebies, uh, the word is Artie Mays and there's a bit of digital washi there and then that page there. It's got the days of the week. That was just from a notepad that I had. And I coffee dyed that. And then here we have got a calling card from the old design shop. And then this is a freebie over on my coffee shop. Some wildflowers, I think they're called. And I stitched all that. So we've got a fabric tab. We've got some uh, stamping there as well. Somewhere to write. Two more tags. 
uh, that is Field Knot Slayer Tags from Tracy Fox and the tag in the background there is from Tag Fabrication. These little um, elements are from Artie Mays and that is from Ruby and Pearl. The clusters, um, I don't know if I should, I did do a video, oh no it was the blue ones I done, um, I done a video on clusters like last week and they were blue ones but then I done a show and tell of all the ones because I was supposed to do a video but it videoed on slow-mo anyway uh this is a piece from Artie Mays and then here we've got that is from Field Notes Layer Tags Tracy Fox and this is just a little journal piece there so it's this was an idea from Clemmy, Clemmy Creations. I haven't seen Clemmy in ages on YouTube. She came on, oh, maybe a year or so ago and said that she was back. And then I haven't seen anything else since. Um, this is from TaylorMade Journals. We've got a little kind of cluster stuck straight down onto the page, which is Digital Washi from Chapter One. This is from Tracy Fox and the Butterflies Artie Mays. Then here we've got two tags, filled knots layered tags, and the tag in the background there is tag fabrication. And I'm just checking them in frame. Uh, image is Ruby and Pearl, and that and that is Artie Mace. And then a little cluster there. We've got some white crochet to trim, some squared paper there. Then here we have um, a journal card there from the old design shop. Then this is from the old design shop as well. That is from the Etsy. That is from the blog. So you'll find them, uh, the old design shop listed below as well as a few other ladies. Go and check them out. That is a freebie from my coffee shop. You'll find a link below to that. And then obviously some stamping. Centre of the signature. More journal space there. Here we've got um, another tag. Again, that's a freebie from my coffee shop. And that is the old design shop from the Etsy store. Pom pom trim. Two tags here. Layered field knots, uh, field knots layered tags from Tracy Fox. And tag fabrication, Ruby and Pearl, Artie Mace. Little cluster I popped on there. Fabric tab little cluster glued straight down onto the page then here I just made a little scrappy notebook I think that paper is from Ruby and Pearl this is a freebie from my coffee shop this little journal card there got a butterfly and some digital washi I stitched all that because uh, it was this was just like printed out onto paper just normal paper and um, I just obviously stitched the coffee dyed on the back so I'm just using up some scrap pieces here. Uh, this is some pink avocado paper. Coffee dyed paper, the avocado, that's a little flip there. Paper, paper, Artie Mace. And then that just goes on there like so. And we've got that little, <laughs> oh, excuse me. Um, that was a hiccupy burp. <laughs> then uh, tag fabrication. And we can't hear my stomach. I've actually did not long eaten. I don't know why my stomach's growling. Uh, probably because I just ate some chocolate as well, actually. It doesn't really go down well sometimes. <laughs> um, Field Knots Layer Tags. Ruby and Pearl. Freebie Butterfly on my coffee shop. That is Artie Mays. Um, little cluster I popped on there. Fabric Tab. Uh, stamping. Another field knots laid tag here, squared paper. Why is that stuck? Why have I literally just got stuck to that? Oh, my watch actually caught onto the cotton there. <laughs> that was strange. Oh dear. It only happens on camera, you know. <laughs> um, right, that comes off. Or does it? Yeah, yeah it does. We'll take that off in a minute to show you. Just showing you that this flips out like that. And obviously that goes back on there. And then that is from the old design shop. That goes on there. And that is a freebie from my coffee shop. 
another little tag that's tag fabrication in the background ruby and pearl image and the butterfly is a freebie uh, on my coffee shop little cluster there and then here that actually opens out and that tucks in there like so so that it can be it can be stayed <laughs> It can stay like that, but you can tuck it in there. Done some stitching and the little cluster that I made. Um, and then another one of these, just a little journal spot. So it is. Oops, that one nearly went flying. Okay, so that is the journal. So hope you like it. Um, like I said, it will be listed over on my uh, website I will have a direct link to that below if you have any questions just ask and thank you for watching bye